Hello guys, welcome back to Rasmus Dam God TV. If you haven't joined the awesome and the best cocktail family of the internet, then join. So today we're making a twist on espresso martini. Espresso martini twist. Today we twist it with some licorice and some dark rum. That's the twist. Licorice is a, is a Danish thing, but I really think the licorice makes uh, plays really well with the coffee. In espresso martini, we use dark rum. Good quality dark rum. Espresso, of course. If you don't have espresso, then use strong coffee. Sugar syrup, only a bit of it, not too much in this cocktail. It's really easy to mix. One part sugar, one part water. Then we have some licorice uh, liqueur. And this one is amazing, it's Danish, that's why I love it. And it's also from my hometown, which is even better. Not to forget, some coffee liqueur, of course. We start off by chilling our cocktail glass. Then in this cocktail, in this cocktail we also need our cocktail shaker. Woo. Yeah! And we start off by filling this one with lots of ice. Oh yeah! 3 centiliters of great dark rum. We take 5 centiliters of espresso. Half a centiliter of sugar syrup. So not that much. One and a half centiliters of our licorice liqueur. And our coffee liqueur. One and a half centiliter. And then we're gonna shake this cocktail. Fast and quickly. One, two, three, go. Yeah, look at this. Foam. And let's taste and see if it's good enough for serving. It's nice. We shake it because we want to chill it down, but we don't want to get it too watery. And we also want to mix all this stuff together. And we also want to create the foam. That's why we do it fast and quickly. So we throw out the ice. We don't want ice in our cocktail glass. No, no, no. And then we're gonna strain the cocktail because we don't want ice in our cocktail glass. And we do that with a strainer. Strain the cocktail. We garnish with a liquid pipe. That's my licorice espresso martini. I think this one is good. This is good stuff. Um, Rasmus Stamgaard TV, licorice espresso martini.